To begin our analysis, let's load in a weather file. We will continue to use Detroit, Michigan as our default location. Now select the grid tool and choose to display the analysis grid. Next, let's adjust the grid extents. Move to a plan view in order to more easily move the boundaries. Next, in the Grid Management dialog, let's increase the number of cells within our grid in order to create a more detailed analysis. If necessary, we can also change the offset in order to bring the grid up to the second floor. After the grid has been set, select the Lighting Levels option under Calculations and perform the analysis. We are now presented with a wizard used to determine how the light should be calculated. Let's use Natural and Electric Lights. Calculate values over the analysis grid. Use the default setting for ray tracing. Now set the sky luminance and window cleanliness. Use the standard accuracy. Review the summary and select OK to perform the calculations. When finished, we can see that higher daylight factors, shown in red, are located near the windows, while the rest of the room has a daylight factor of about 1%. We can also change the grid to display daylighting levels, which measures the brightness in foot candles.